Okay, so what do you know, people? Another thunderstorm. This is just great. Beautiful. So we're supposed to be in the El Nino and it's supposed to be drying out, but basically we're getting a shitload of rain. So, mm, well, that's what happens when you actually put a lot of uh, items into the atmosphere that can uh, contain heat, you get more evaporation. So then you have more rain in the actual atmosphere. So it's quite nice. So if you're interested, you can go to Paul Beckwith. He has a good website. Over there, that's actually clear. So what you're seeing, some cloud, but uh, it's pretty clear down there. What you would be seeing. Okay, so that's looking to the north. Okay. So you can see then south, and it's heading towards Melbourne. And it's quite clear. But you yeah, look at the north. Look how dark it is. So yesterday all the rain was actually down south and today it's all heading up north. So uh, it's probably just hitting the uh, great uh, sent great Australian oh, the actual mountain range up there. I can't remember what they call it. The Central Highlands, something like that. Ah but beautiful. And it's actually quite warm, it's probably about 26, 27 degrees. And these eucalypts can actually do with it. Uh, these... Looks like they haven't died back. Probably not because of drought, probably because of too much rain. And there's a lot of young eucalypts growing in there. Beautiful. And there's that tree, that tree over there. That's probably about, you know, I'd say 100, 150 years old, probably even 200. So that's pretty much been there before human colonization. And these ones grew up, since, these are about 70, 80, before this train line is here. They had yeah, a train line up into the 1970s and then they ripped it up and they had to put this noisy bastard in. So, that is a uh, beautiful rain. So this is pretty unusual for us. Uh, that we have two rainstorms consecutive days. Usually we have it you know, like one day and that's about it. Then we don't have it for a few weeks. But the temperature actually hasn't actually gotten high. So it hasn't had anything so we haven't had any temperatures that reach pretty much into over 35 I think what we've had is probably about 32 usually by the now we had temperatures reaching up to 40 so something unusual going on here so if I got in my car and I drove probably Five kilometers up that way I doubt you get any rain because where I am now is pretty much the border of the rain region and if I go you know five kilometers up that way uh, my car will get washed so that is basically what's going on today in Melbourne let me know what's happening in your neck of the woods Obviously, there's going to be flooding today. Possibly up north, so Kyneaton, Nagambi, and Nagambi's pretty full. Uh, anyway, we're going to go up to Nagambi later and just check out the actual geology because most of it's uh, Permian.